I'd say it's been about 90 days, exposure to Agent Builder, to doing a hackathon, to exposing it to our team members. Soon enough, in about two, three weeks, we'll be at Groundbreak. Like, it's phenomenal how quick this is moving. Wild. Like, who knew? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. What we are having them do today is come in and experiment with this early version of our Agent Builder. Austin was amazing. It was super fun just to be there with other peers and to just see what's possible. Which one do you guys think we should start with first? They're trying to solve problems. Some of them are pretty complex. They're not looking for ChatGPT. They're looking for a closeout agent, right? And the way that they do closeout is very specific. So agents would be totally new for us. This is the first time I'm touching one. Ethan's awesome. He's been very instrumental in understanding Assist, so he was a natural fit to go ahead and send to this hackathon. You like oh, this, I love the suspense, but it's like thinking and I'm just waiting to see what's going to come out. So we're trying to troubleshoot the agent to see how we can combine the right tools to make it perform the correct action. What box are you all using? You all have the submittal. You know, the first agent I built, I just started vomiting words in and it didn't work that well. Even though I said staff electric, it got the full contract. And then I asked the agent to rewrite the prompt. It worked great on the first try. So gets, gets there. The ability to build an agent was surprisingly easy. What we've seen so far is literally mind-blowing. The possibilities are endless. Shows you late submittals. Um, the framework of it. We do have a couple projects that have started to use agents. Uh, so the first thing we did is define the goal. The way Mortensen is looking at agents is what's the easy stuff we can get off the plate of our project teams to help them be better builders, just improve their everyday life. The information I wanted and it figured it out for me. I, I really do feel like this is a groundbreaking technology and this is going to change how we do everything. This is the next big thing. The intelligence layer in agents builders give our project teams the ability to build what they need. Mortensen's excited about agents because it actually challenges us to look at the workflows we have today new tools that would allow them to think differently about their process, I think unlocks a whole new wave of possibilities. Powered by Procore, built by Mortensen. Every project team member is in Procore every day. It is part of their DNA. The data is in Procore. Using agents to help filter, move, and sort that will be extremely powerful for team members. What would it look like to review documents ahead of the authorship of an RFI? It's not just to drive automation around the workflow we do today. But what might it do to inform our design partners around some of their historical practices and completely shift the way in which we work on site?